Well, here's the bracket so far that I've that I've made up. Um, it's a couple of M5 tapped screw screw holes on the ends, um, and obviously the slot in the scale allows me a bit of up and down control. I'm trusting the plate to be flat. Um, this rebate here is provides clearance for this carriage because it's it's not clear exactly where it sits, and I just thought I'd rather I'd rather have a bit of clearance than not. And then under here, what we've got is a couple of counterboard clearance holes for M6. That'll go into the pads on the machine, and and these locations are centered on those cast pads. Um, so there's a M6 button head screw, both ends, and then I don't have any grub screws in stock, so I'm going to make some out of out of some uh, M8 in this case uh, bolts, and the grub screws are just going to have kind of a slight dome on one end, and I'm going to sort of polish that on the buff, and they'll be about as long as this is thick, because I don't want it to foul any of this stuff. And I'll just cut a slot in one end. I can change them out for um, hex grub screws later on. But all those threads are tapped. And yeah, we've got M8, uh, M5 um, screw cap screws to hold the scale on. So I think that's about all the prep work I can do. Now it's really it's time to drill the castings on the um, knee of the mill and bolt this on screw this on and tram it in. Well, apart from making up the um, little grub screws to set the set the level of this plane, I think this is pretty close to being ready. And it's really rigid, and yeah, I, I didn't need to worry about anything. There's no way that's there's no way that's going to be uh, a problem that mounting. Um, so I'll get the grub screws made up next time, and I'll get this plate trammed in, and then we'll start thinking about the bracket that comes from here. Might be able to use um, might be able to use one of the angle plates that came with the kit. They don't look that great, but I'll, I'll have a look and see how much I can use. Okay, that's all for now. See you next time.